what exactly what happens to a glass of water or a pitcher of water when I put it inside a ring? Well, it increases the available energy in the water instantaneously. It causes water to emit light and it causes uh, an expansion of the atomic radius. Now this is a deductive process and the way we came to this was through the use of an instrument which would uh, detect the change or increase in the available light being emitted from water. In other words, water has a, a certain level of energy uh, as it sits in the glass there or exists in your water pipes or in a lake or stream. So <clears throat> what we found is that the rings cause an increase in energy which manifests as an increase in full spectrum light all the way from infrared on up to ultraviolet. And I'll, I'll put some graphics on the board here after a while. But the increase in light energy can only occur if the electron orbit expands, rotates at a, a greater distance from the nucleus, and then falls back slightly to the next energy level. And when it falls back to the next energy level, it emits a photon. So here's this little bitty energy package we call an atom with electrons whirling around it. They encounter the energy field of the ring. It expands. The electrons have a larger orbit. They fall back to their natural state and emit energy in the form of light. 